All right, guys, Splits here, and I'm going to show you how to download Fortnite on PC so you can start playing Battle Royale, Zero Build, or Creative, or any of these games that you see right here. And I'm pretty sure everyone watching this knows that Fortnite is 100% free to download. Now, you would think it would be on Steam, but I'm actually going to show you what happens when you type in Fortnite on Steam. And you guys can see no matter how far down you go on this list, like you'll never see the official Fortnite. So yeah, don't be that guy that searches Fortnite on Steam. I'm going to show you how to download it the right way. And just real quick, since I have 50 V-Bucks, let's try to get this video to exactly 50 likes. Hopefully it doesn't go over that. And yeah, let's get right into it. All right, the first thing you want to do, just go to your browser and just type in Epic Games. And then just click on the first one. And this is what the Epic Games site looks like. And I'll put the link down below so you can just click on it. And it'll take you exactly here. So once you're on the site, if you look on the top right, you'll see it says download. That's where you want to go. So click on that. And then just download it wherever. I'm just going to save it to my downloads and hit save. And you can see that it's already downloaded. So just click on this. And now it's going to start the launcher setup. So I'm actually going to close out of this web browser because we don't need it no more. And then once you're here, just want to hit install. And then just click yes on this. And it's going to start installing the Epic Games launcher. All right, the Epic Games launcher is now fully installed. And you may have noticed that it also made a shortcut to your desktop. So now we just need to sign in, but if you don't have an account, you can easily create one right here. So I'm just signing into my account. Okay, I'm now signed into my Epic Games account. And if you guys don't know what this is, this is basically like Steam, but it's made by Epic Games. So now we can actually start downloading Fortnite. So just go to the search right here and type in Fortnite and then just click on this one. And if you scroll down a little bit, you'll see this. So. If you look on the right right here, you'll see it says in library because I've already downloaded Fortnite before. So for you, it might say get, but it's the same process. Just click on it and then you'll see this. So here's the Fortnite. Just click it and then you can just save it wherever. I'm just going to leave everything default. So just hit install and then just click yes on this. So now it's going to start downloading. You guys can see it says installing. So the real question is, I know everyone wants to know how many gigabytes is Fortnite? So to check, you just want to go to your downloads right here and let's see. So it's 65 gigabytes, which is kind of a lot. So for me, this is probably going to take me a couple of days. 2000 years later. All right. Fortnite is now fully downloaded and it also made a shortcut right here. So now we can go to the quick launch and launch it for the first time. So here we go. Three, two, one. And here it is. Fortnite is now on my PC. So you can start playing battle royale, zero build, creative, and I'm only level one, so I gotta start playing. But yeah, that's pretty much it. That's how you download Fortnite on PC. Make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe. This helped you out. And yeah.